Hey, what's going on, guys? My name is Red Flame Lord Five. Dude, I waved at my camera like like they could see me. I, I looked and I waved. Put it on. Uh, no, I'm I'm naked. No, you're not. <laughs> you don't know. I do, I do know. And it doesn't matter. We can't we can't see you anyways. Is your camera position? I'm naked. So I just I just beat Ornstein and Smo, and oh, it's time. Or I I I talked to I think her name's Guinevere up here. I don't remember. Oh shit. Okay. Uh, and then I killed her. I shot. I I threw a firebomb at her head. So now, oh fuck. I'm gonna go fight, uh, Gwendolyn. I'm making sure I'm not walking into a trap. Holy fuck. Awesome. Oh, he's trying to parry me. Player type enemies are the fucking worst. Whatever. Wasn't too bad. It's it's really jarring going from playing Elden Ring though, and then and then coming in and playing this. So just got done playing Elden Ring. Uh I'm trying to remember. I'm pretty sure I explored most most of this place. And Orlando is very easy to explore because it's so fucking just open. What you're seeing now is, is how most of Anor Orlando looks. Uh, oh, I need more Demon Titanite. <laughs> Demon Titanite is so fucking tough to get in this. So. There's a chance my weapon here does not go past plus four. Which it maxes out at plus five. Right down here we have the firekeeper for Anolondo. It kinda it's really inconvenient to kill her, but you get a firekeeper soul, which is pretty good. Uh I'm contemplating whether I should or not. I will. Why not? So it's... <laughs> you... Holy fuck. Thank you for letting me go. Such a fucking idiot. Yeah. 
Yo, wait. This ain't the same bonfire, though. I'm gonna walk around hollow for a bit. Just because I don't feel like consuming more humanity. It's not worth it. She should- fuck. I hope she's still there. I wanna kill her. I know I could fast travel out of here, but I just have more I want to do. Where I go. Oh my God. You know, I bet if I were to parry her, she would not go down like that. So I guess why she was helping us before, um, it's because we had, like, something to offer her. The whole, the whole point of the game is, you go and, and kill Gwyn because, uh, like, somebody has to, I guess, succeed him in kindling the flame, like, so we're technically becoming the Lord of Anor Londo, or, or Londo, or whatever the fuck. Um, so she was helping us before because I guess we promised glory or something. Spawn, that's how. You get a firekeeper soul. Um yeah, now I'm gonna go lower this and we're gonna fight Gwendolyn. Which Gwendolyn is so fucking silly. Oh shit. I don't remember which way we push it. Before this was closed, there was like a statue of Lord Gwyn here. This boss is real goofy.
First thou offendest the Godmother, and now thou see fit to trample upon the tomb of the Great Lord. I am the Dark Sun, Gwyndolin. Let the atonement for thy felonies commence it. Yeah, so... Gwyndolin was, a. Uh... Gwendolyn is a boy, but I guess he had he had high affinity for moon magic, so they uh, he was like raised as a chick. Ouch! Yeah, this boss is kind of fucking stupid. <laughs> Especially for, like, a sword build, like I have now. Here's my opportunity, and the bow comes out. This is uh, awesome. <laughs> Holy shit! Yeah, you can go. Uh, that fucking hurt. It's like one little thing hit me. Bye bye. Bye, Gwendolyn. Swathed in dark, an eternal curse upon thee. Since you're dodging, anyways, I think I'd take them clothes off. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I don't really. Yeah, I, I'm. I'm not like fat rolling, so I kind of don't mind. I, just, I, kinda, I like how the armor looks. That's why I wear it, if you really want to know. Um. Alright. Whoa. Cool. Sunlight blade. Will not be using that. Um, it's cool armor. I can't help boss ladying. It's the only way to fuel my ego. I mean, yeah, there there are always more efficient ways to fight that boss. You could, you could sit there and shoot Gwendolyn with a with a great bow if you wanted. The, the, there's a point where if you stand back enough. Like, Gwendolyn literally won't shoot at you, so... You could just kill him. But... This is my first playthrough on PC, so I decided I would replicate my first playthrough on PlayStation. <laughs> oh yeah, for sure. It's, it's one of the coolest ones in the game. I think it fits the boss as well.
I could probably do uh, Oriamas here. I think. I'm a little under leveled for it, but. Well, according to the internet. Ouch. Oh my god, I am surrounded. <laughs> oh my god, I'll pillage your friend's body right in front of you. Shields trivialize this game so fucking much. I love them. To Ariamis. <laughs> Stock surprise sound effect. So this is a uh, this is Arian Dell, and remember we picked up that doll. I'll read the description again. There was once an abomination who had no place in this world. She clutched this doll tightly, and eventually was drawn into a cold and lonely painted world. Yeah. So from that, you can kind of discern that uh, people who the gods deem don't belong in the world belong in Ariamis. So Maybe I will run a different armor set here. I definitely can. Uh, ooh, actually I might not, because... I'm not using Cavill's ring. So I'm a little heavy. So the stats on it even better though. Oh, in every conceivable way. How did that happen? <laughs> I 
Um, it's gotta be an online thing. Maybe my oh maybe my message got an appraisal. I don't know, but I don't think I've even left messages though. I think I was going to, but I decided not to because I think I got attacked or something. Nice. We'll wear this. Oh yeah, uh, that was that was my buddy Jacob. Hey man. I'm doing a full scan on my computer. It's gonna take like an hour now. What do you think? It, it, it had to have been the had been attempt at installing that. Yeah. But I, I went in and I deleted every file of what I did. Let's not always do the trick. Yeah. Now I'm just I'm just doing scans. You know, trying to like I did a clean boot thing. I didn't I don't think it did fix it at all. But I just opened everything back again. I could check. I also saw a video specifically for Borderlands. Where the black screen pops up. But I don't even think it's that, because it just happened to Wulong as well. Alright, it won't take an hour, I guess. Because it it's already scanned 180, 191,000 files. It, did, it went from an hour and a half to a minute. It was at 35 hours in the beginning. I hear a lot of things aggroed on me here. I'm not a big fan of this helmet. I don't like the thing coming out of the damn back. It's a whole another weapon. If you're not gonna like backwards headbutt with this thing, then you ain't using it right. Oh, I forgot to read the item description for her armor. <laughs> really, I think you're stuck. Hey, I love toxic damage. I love toxic damage. I do not have a lot of, uh, yeah, well, Big well, purple mosses. I don't hit one though. Got two up here. Die. Yeah, new time. Oh. I hate these guys. so weird walking around with a crest shield in this katana looks so odd You know, there are all these, like, really useful commands to know about your computer. <laughs> and nowhere does it say where these things are. Like, so if I was to go into, like, the, the command prompt. It's because things like that are designed for people who already know, like, 
how to yeah like what to do when they see that shit that's why hey it, it's scanned there are no threats it's, it's scanned at 696,042 files It could be that whenever I leave. I'm think you know what I'm thinking, and it, you might you might not agree. I'm thinking it's your GPU, it's your graphics card. Because how do you think that? I don't see what else it could be. <laughs> Youch! <laughs> Bro, she's got a thing going up her butt. <laughs> I got flasks. Do you fall off? What a place to fight an enemy like that. all the sparkling is that me <laughs> look how pretty this game is awesome Since I'm safe and I've got time, I'll read some of the uh, item descriptions because I just didn't think to do it. Soul of Dark Moon Gwendolyn, God of the Dark, Sun and Guardian of Deserted and Orlando. Fuck. Oh, God of the Dark Sun. <laughs> okay. Special beings have special souls. Use the soul of Gwyn's last born. To acquire a huge amount of souls, or to create a unique weapon. Awesome. Um. Soul of the Dark Moon Nidus. A Firekeeper soul is a draw for humanity, and held within their blo their bosoms. Below just a thin layer of skin are swarms of humanity that writhe and squirm. Her brass armor serves to disguise this ghastly form. Um, I think I also got here sunlight blade. Mirka wielded by Lord Gwyn's firstborn. Uh, Boost right weapon with rays of sun. The power of sunlight, manifested as lightning. Uh, it is very effective against dragons. When the eldest son was stripped of his deific status, he left on his, he left this on his father's coffin, perhaps as a final farewell. Hmm. That's cool. How else have I gotten? Love menus. Helm of the Dark Moon Nidus, Firekeeper of Anor Orlando. After becoming undead, she visited the Dark Sun Gwendolyn at the Mausoleum of the Spiral Depths. It became a blade of the Dark Moon threats and assumed the flame keeping duty. Thank you for, for interrupting me, Jackass. Uh, became a blade of the Dark Moon and assumed the flame keeping duty. She received this helm, which hides her hideous form and helps her hunt the guilty. Pretty neat, pretty neat. Right. 
it. Yeah, so the little terminal thing popped up again. And it immediately my is notified that a threat was detected. So I clicked on the little notification. It brought me to something. There's no it did not tell me how to what to do at all. drop downs where I won't be able to get back to where I came from quite yet. I'm fighting Phalanx from Demon Souls here. Oh, this is shit. awesome. Uh, protecting history. Uh, threat block. And it says severe. Oh my god. What is that? Okay. I, I need to figure out what I'm supposed to do with this, this information. Status removed. A threat or app is removed from this device. The program is dangerous and executes commands from an attacker. Affected items. Update a local temp and it says something.dll. Action. Grant emulates games, you'll have to ask him um, how, how to safely emulate shit, because whatever you did was a big mistake. I, I, I'm certain whatever that install is, was pulled from an emulator. Here we go. I, I found the, like, the threat. I went to my... Threat can perform a number of actions of malicious hackers' choice in the PC. Do now, like the threats, this 10 defender, safety scanner, run up run a full scan. I did that, didn't, didn't say it, found anything. So here's, here's what it is it's Trojan, uh, two dots. Win32 slash EOP LIK VIB dot A. I'm not going to climb down there just yet, but I'll look around a little more. Another shortcut door that's right up here. So I guess I'll come here. I wonder if I can level up. If I can't, I've got souls to eat, so I'll be fine. Oh, I didn't even check. 
fucking silly as hell. All these jackasses are gonna be here again. I guess it's free souls, huh? I'll fight him again. Why not? It's better than them being here. Dark Spirit King Jeremiah. I love this guy. He's got a funny hat. Damn. Ariamas, they've, they've really got a uh, fuck ton of Demon Souls references here. Happy I didn't run in there. Just thinking about it. Boy, son of a bitch. Do I get his funny hat? I didn't see what I picked up. I don't think it was his funny hat. Yeah, I think I just got humanity. I wonder what the King Jeremiah lore is. Another person banished from the outside world, huh? Deemed unfit by the gods, some shit. Or deemed a threat. What if I've read about King Jeremiah in any uh, text logs and it's just like slipping my mind? Pyromancy assets search. This should tell me, right? Give me King Jeremiah lore. Pyromancy foreign to the great, great, great swamp, mid acid, which corrodes weapons and armor. Not all pyromancy originates in the great swamp. One hears rumors of unknown pyromancers inhabiting various lands, and the spell is the work of one such outlander. King Jeremiah was a pyromancer, so maybe maybe he invented this. And he seemed very powerful, but he's not from. Uh, some of the gods accept, so maybe that's why he was banished.
go this way now. I'm just gonna take a look around though, I'm not gonna... Uh... Actually, why not? Alright, I'm doing another... Uh, scan. Separate Microsoft scanner. It says that... The thing was removed. But I don't, I don't even know, like... That means permanently. This is really fucking annoying. I really needed to em emulate Pokemon. I needed Pokemon. I want to play it. I'm not, I'm not spending it. $500 on a DS. So I can play one video game. Probably takes me down below. I mean, I'll, I'm gonna, I'll check it out. Why not? But if this is the area I think it is, I don't want to be here. Yep, not there yet. <laughs> we'll come back. I think I like missed a spot in the that first little area here. I remember going up that tower. Doing pretty good on humanities right now. Okay. There was a little drop down area I wanted to investigate over here, but I'm not sure I could access that quite right now. I'm gonna kill this rat bastard because he's annoying. I'm sure I don't I didn't have to access it like this, but <laughs> have I already been here? It's a chance I have.
This looks like a long shot, but interesting. Gold coin. Will not be using that. <laughs> Seriously, come on. <laughs> and bro, you didn't have to kill yourself. I mean. Remove his parasitic egg from the body. I forgot you could get that. That's right. The egg bearers have chosen to serve the flame of chaos, and the egg symbolizes this selfless choice. Naturally, these chestnuts are forbidden, but are allowed under special circumstances. <laughs> Some people had to live with like worms in their shit. Sucks. Oh man, you got you got bugs. Fuck you. Your fault. I guess we're all okay. So what do you shit to do? Thanks for the humanity, rat. These rats are all people. That's the that's my theory. But I have no idea. All the way at the bottom, huh? Hood worn by the alabaster cloth guardians of the painted world of the paintings in Anolando offer substantial substantial. Oh God, I cannot read right now. Offer substantial protection versus magic. They have guarded the great paintings of Ariamas for ages, passing their duty down through the generations. But the reason for doing so passed from all memory long ago. So they don't. They don't know why they... Okay. They don't know why they're watching it then. They just are. It's their job, I guess. What a sense of duty.
Bye bye. <laughs> oh. Shit. Those little rotting dragons have like a Tyrannosaurus head. Bro, you're talking to yourself right now. Who fucking cares? You're a weirdo. You're a weirdo. You're crazy. Just don't get it, do ya? <laughs> Alright, buddy. <laughs> Let's just hear it. Sounded like somebody spotted in. Oh, I think the... I think the wheel guy hit the, hit the big wall. Oh hell no! I'm up, bro. I'm never getting out of here. Alrighty. So so far, out of seven hundred and twenty thousand files, two of them are infected. Oh, hold on. Now it's four. Brett, I want to write a message. I've never done this before in this game. Wait, can I? I can't. I can't write messages. As you can tell, I've never, uh, I mean, I've written messages in Elden Ring, but not in this one. I was gonna say, like, sad or some shit, but I'm such a dumbass. I'm so fucking dumb. <laughs> I meant to kill it. I didn't need to get that toxic damage, though. Pyromancy four into the Great Swamp. Create a surge of flame from the palm of hand. Uh, not all pyromancy originates in the Great Swamp. Originates, yeah, I said that right. In the Great Swamp. One hears rumors of unknown pyromancers inhabiting various lands, and this spell is the work of one such outlander. Must be that, that one guy with the funny hat. Must have, been, must have been him. He seems like the type. Been scanning for fifteen minutes. I'm not gonna go in there quite yet.
key to the annex in the painted world of Ariamis. In the, in the wintry painted world, there is a structure resembling an old cathedral. Its annex serves as a type of storehouse. different types of statuses for a threat when it's detected and so it'll either be removed active quarantined or um, blocked so right now this one just says that the status is removed I'm doing a scan anyways just to check I'm never downloading anything ever again. <laughs> I mean, I think, um, just just be a little more careful because emulating is illegal. So, yeah, I know. not saying it's like crazy. Uh, likely that most of it is malware, but like it's easier to get away with installing malware when you're installing something illegal, anyways. You know. Mm -hmm. I'm just trying to make sure that when it finds a threat, that it is deleted. I I need to make sure. Mm. And it doesn't really tell me exactly how to make sure. I'm kind of just trying all these methods to make sure, to ensure that it, it is gone. All right. Before I continue, I'm gonna rest. And because well, I've got a bunch of levels, but I'm also gonna go and see about um. Putting my firekeeper soul in the fire. <laughs> Borderlands might also not be working because the GPU might be overclocked because of some of the NVIDIA settings. I might have to change that so that it, it runs right. Oh shit, just kidding. Can't I bring already the fire to there yet. Katana's on the spot. Oh, the blood stains under the snow. Weird. What? 
Does the scan have completed successfully and no viruses, spyware, or other potentially unwanted software would have made it? You continue to experience issues. Ask the community. <laughs> no thanks. I will not be asking the community anything. The community is, is full of a bunch of idiots. I think you're the idiot, dude. I think you need to shut your damn mouth. Yeah, all right, fair, fair, fair enough. Yeah, man, your, your idiocy is contagious. Your idiocy is is uh getting past my cybersecurity. Look at my PC run dumb. I'm gonna restart my computer. I'm gonna go this way first. Oh, Andre, no! It's very close. I, I'll be honest, I was not ready for them at all. Something just told me I gotta drop my inventory now. I gotta see. Uh, oh, where the fuck is it? You would think it would be in key items, right? Ah, here it is. Ember, uh, ember required for weapon ascension. The church long hid the forbidden black ember, and no living blacksmith knows of it. Ascend plus five divine weapons to occult weapons. Occult weapons can be reinforced to plus five. Occult weapons were used to hunt gods and are effective against their followers and kin. Damn, man. That's really cool. I, I won't be touching that either. Velka's Rapier. I love this area, it's so cool. A symbolic, uh, powerful thrusting sword used by the Pardoner serving Velka, goddess of sin. It is no mere symbol to be sure. The Pardoner is an inhuman swordsman. It wields this enchanted blade with special sword technique. Secret rite of the black-haired witch Velka uh, prevents casting of magic within within effect area. Velka, the goddess of sin, is a rogue deity. Uh, she is versed in arts both new and old, and is considered to have a great range of influence, even as gods are concerned. Yeah. Velka, the goddess of sin. Uh, I don't really know what she's done. Like why she, she's significant. I would need to. Oh, okay. I got more to read right now. But her name is mentioned throughout the entire series, so... 
might not get it all in Dark Souls 1. That's okay, though. Mask won by Pardoners serving Velka, the Goddess of Sin. The Pardoners listen to the confessions of sinners, urging reflection and salvation. Their masks symbolize yeah, separation from worldly desires. Uh, robe worn by Pardoners serving Velka, the Goddess of Sin. Uh, the Pardoners' attire is uniformly black in color and said to be imbued with Velka's mystical power, which provides resistance to all manner of magic. Damn. That's crazy. Alright. You can talk now, Jacob. Yeah, permission. Dragon scale, cool. Blood shield. Dragon scale. Uh, a dragon is inseparable from its scales, uh, and the transcendent apostles who seek the perpetuity of the ancient dragons have crossed the very end of the earth to seek this invaluable treasure. Hmm, so interesting. Oh, wait, I also got another thing I wanted to read, but I don't remember at all what it was. Oops. Oh, yeah, Blood Shield. Blood shield spoken of in the Lost Legends. The red of blood is slightly enchanted and boosts various resistances. It's got 100% damage reduction. It's very weak against blocking magic, but it's pretty good against everything else. The thing is, though. Magic is such a pain in the ass. And I have this. Why would I use the blood shield? A little heavy when I use that shield, but I'll have it in a minute. Now, this guy's here, and he's he's pretty funny, because if you want to get past him, you could just hit him. And, uh... He'll, he'll eventually stand up if you keep hitting him. But you're not supposed to do it like that. It's just a glitch in the game. So I guess eventually you stagger after after fucking 90 hits. This place gets really, really good souls.
Now, I know what, what's ahead here. And I don't want to go there yet. I want to rest. So it's kind of a baby move, but I'm going to go back and rest first. Also, uh, I don't know if I mentioned, this weapon scales with uh, humanity as well, so it does extra damage because I have two humanity here. Now, the reason I don't just pop all my humanity at once is because uh, I'm not a fool. That's it. I'm not confident in my ability to go throughout this entire game without dying at all, so... Probably gonna fight these guys on the bridge again. I don't. I don't think I can run past them. Easy. Just fine. Oh, please. I heard him stomping behind me. I do I had to finish them quick. I don't even want to kill you, I want to kill the little guy, please. I don't have to fight him. It's not worth it. Do we have Priscilla? F3 Priscilla to be precise. She's like part dragon, part human. Who art thou? One of us thou art not. If thou hast been stepped into this world, plunge down from the plank and hurry home. If thou seekest I, thine desires shall be requited not. And this, in in my memory, is the only boss that doesn't just want to kill you straight off the bat. Thou must returneth whence thou came. This land is peaceful. Its inhabitants kind, but thou dost not belong. I beg of thee, plunge down from the plank and hurry home. Thou must return it this I no, But unfortunately, I want her boss sold because her weapon is really cool, so. I expected as much from thee. Why dost thee hurry toward thine death?
Yep. I feel bad for that one. Rest in peace. Uh, soul of Cr Priscilla the Crossbreed, trapped inside the painted world of Ariamis. Special beings have special souls. Oh. Use the soul of this crossbreed, crossbreed bastard child and antithesis to all life. That's not what she was. Now I'm going to use that homework bone because fuck this. I'm not fighting through all those guys again. Oh my god. Oh no. Why the fuck would it take me here? Why would I want to come here? That homeward bone was just a troll. <sighs> and there's no lever over here, so I gotta go back this way. So fucking stupid. I always walk through that because it messes with the camera for whatever reason. It'll like jerk it slightly left while you're walking forward. You might fall. I've never died up here in this top section, so it's not actually that bad. It's just a little annoying. I don't want to run back through here. But I'm pretty sure every time I teleport back to Anno Orlando, I'm going to have to. Like, I, it'll, it'll teleport me back there, but... To my knowledge... This is- I've seen everything here already, so I won't actually have to come back here if I don't want to. Just great news, because I'm, I'm just about fed up with this. People love invading here. They love it. These throwing knives don't do any knockback, so. Clown. Oh yeah, this one has a lever.
Bro, I bet so many people have tried to jump on it here. It's way further than it looks. But it's also a big ass mechanism, so. Alright, so where I'm gonna run seems silly, but gotta trust the process. What the hell? If it sits like this, if I ever do feel like coming back to Anor Orlando, and it teleports me up there again, um, I won't have to go up and around. Oh yeah, my reasoning for coming to Anor Orlando, why I would come back here is the blacksmith. I remember. Blacksmith is wonderful. Ornstein and Smo had a beautiful boss arena as well. It's fucking really cool. Damn. This dude's getting tossed. Ooh. See, I, I have bad impulse control. I want to jump in there so fucking bad. Looks fun. Uh, where do I want to go? Where do I want to go? Talk to Frampt. That's what we'll do. Sigmeyer! Well, fancy meeting you here. You did much for me up above. I am grateful. You know, I was thinking the gate, the old portal. Is that your doing? Yes, I knew it. It seemed like an unlikely coincidence. Well, am I fortunate? This light of Catalina thanks you sincerely. Please, take this as a token of my gratitude. There you are. I'll be heading down below shortly. There's nothing worthwhile up above. No worries. Venting is my life. I'm prepared for the worst. <laughs> There you are. <laughs> uh, oh, it's a miracle. Outland Miracle, born to the way of light, emits shockwave. Considered an alternate bra uh, branching of force, emits an expanding shockwave orb. Weird. Again, I was waiting to tell you. Master Logan has returned, and he tells me that he has you to thank. Well, we are both in your debt now. Thank you, sincerely. He's just over there. Go along and have a chat. Oh, hello. Terrific to see us both in one piece, and pray that you never go hollow. <laughs> this guy's such a oh, hello. weirdo. Terrific to see and pray. Hello there. Big Cat Logan. As promised, I will share my sorceries. Mm. Mm. I'm mm. afraid that you are unable to learn sorcery. The basic framework, you see, it cannot be taught. Oh, do not fret. Life isn't all about sorcery. You will find your own way. Don't frown with regret. Peer forward with your head high. Hello there. Glad to see you alive. Wait, why can't I learn sorcery? Hello. 
Oh, hello. And pray that you. All right. But I don't really need it. Whoa! No. I want to jump for joy. It's so sad, my friend. Ah, oh, you. Have you seen my lady? Oh, blast! Where might she be? And would she be safe? Oh, I'm sorry. Sometimes I lose my. Fuck you. Retrieved the Lord Vessel after a thousand years. It is you. It is really you. You do it again. <laughs> Forgive me. I really should calm down. Now, let us take that vessel on a journey. I assume that you are ready. Now. Be still. No, I'm dead. Just kidding. of Lord Gwyn. Now, place the Lord Vessel on the altar. No. What is it? No reason for... What is it? No... The fuck is this? This is an interesting structure, too. I still have Soul of Snow. Very well, as King Seeker. I shall now instruct you, the Lord's successor, in your next task. To achieve your fate, fill the vessel with powerful souls, commensurate to the great soul of wind. Scarce few possess such brilliant souls. Brave Lord Nito, the Witch of Isolith, the Four Kings of New Londo, who inherit
inherited the shards of Gwyn Soul, and Lord Gwyn's former confidant, Seek the Scaleless. All of their souls are required to satiate the Lord Vessel. Are you ready? Then we shall return. Stay still for a moment. Awesome. So now we know our objectives. Uh, one of them does require us to go back to Anor Orlando, which we gotta go to the Duke's Archives, I believe. Um, and then go down to Hell and not lost Isolith. I hate that place. It fucking sucks. Uh, the Duke's Archives is pretty bad too, to be honest. Um. The, the Tomb of Giants is pretty fucking bad as well. <laughs> uh, oh, then. Yeah, Blue Londo. It's also really, really awful. Man. I was about to say. Pe people say that the second half of this game is like dog shit. Not like dog shit, but just pretty bad. In comparison to the first half, which is really strong. And, you know, just just now, it kind of clicked. Like, I get it. I kind of understand that. Uh, who do I want to do first? I think I'll do... I think maybe I'll do New Londo first, but there are a few places that, uh, no, 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 actually, actually, we'll do... Mm. Oh, whoa, 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 getting a little distracted. We'll do Gravelord Nido first. Because I haven't gone through the catacombs at all, and there's stuff I need in the catacombs. <laughs> what the... I'm having this recurring problem, where... Restart the computer. It'll turn off, but it won't turn back on. And the keyboard completely shuts off. Like it's, it's like it's not even connected to the computer. You no, know, it's plugged in. The wired thing. So when I turn it on, turn it back off, the computer turns on, but the keyboard doesn't. Nor, nor does it connect to the screen where I can see what I'm actually doing. The computer is just on. No, there's no like HDMI signal. Oh, I have to turn it off, like power switch and everything. Turn it on. And even then, it might not even work. I got lucky this time and it actually turned on. That's fucking, that's scary as shit. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I think you need to take it in to get it, like, looked at. Probably. Cause that's, that's like, that's, the, the computer is near not working, so. Alright. 
I think I'm gonna end stream. We did we didn't do a very long one today. Like the, the last two were like fucking six to eight hours, I think. This one was not six to eight hours. <laughs> uh but that's fine. When next time I stream, I'll do the catacombs. And then I'll uh probably explore that that one fucking place. The uh like the big tree with all the roots and shit. With the lizard to keep that and descend that, because I've never actually gone down there. Uh actually no, we'll do that after the Duke's archives because there's a quest line. Um, yeah, it's a fun stream, I had a good time, I love, I just love playing this game. I like looking at the lore and stuff, even if it doesn't all, like, even, uh, like, click in my head all the time, like, if I can't recall it, it's still fun. Alright, see ya.